everyone welcome to my channel today i am going to share my project where i studied hotel booking data a atli grant a big hotel company need i understand their problem and help that businesses to grow their revenue and market share so without wasting time let's deep dive into this project these are the content that we are going to cover throughout our presentation problem statement objective tool and data set analysis process plan data cleaning key insight recommendation and lastly impact and outcome now the problem statement a atli grant is a very popular hotel in india but nowadays they are facing a challenges their customer and revenues also going down so they need so they don't have a data team so they need someone who can understand their uh, booking data helps them to find a helpful solution to grow their businesses these are the atlic hotels atlic season exotica bay palace and this atlic hotel have their different rooms like standard elite premium and presidential now let's understand the project objective the main goal of this project to look the booking data understand what was working and what's not and suggest a simple way to atli grant to help to grow in their business now let's understand the data pipeline so in this picture you can see that the booking data is coming from the different sources from make your trip log trip tripster ligrant.com which is the official website of atli grant and even offline booking so this different sources data is been stored in the system that is called as oltp online transaction processing and after that we use etl offset transform load which means we take the data clean it and store it into the big storage that is called as data warehouse uh, that process is called as oltp online analytical processing after that the data scientists and data analysts use this excel file power bi and pandas to understand the data and make charts and dashboards these are the data sets that i have been used in my project that is dim date dim room uh, fact aggregated booking data date team hotel fact booking and new data august cs these are the tools that i used for cleaning analyzing and visualizing the data python for core language for uh, data analysis Jupyter Notebook for writing and visualizing, and Pandas for data cleaning and analysis. Now let's move ahead with the second part, that is analysis journey, where uh, I collect the data, process, transform, and then generate the key insight. First process was data importing and exploration. First, I import the data. Here you can see I imported the data by reading the CSV file. then i done the data exploration to find the patterns in this data after that next step is data cleaning i had done the data cleaning process to remove the null values to remove the invalid uh, values and outliers here you can see outlier removal in revenue generated next is data transformation processes in that we have to create a occupancy percentage model which means we can understand the how many hotel rooms or hotels are been booked now third part which is the insight generation which is a very important part here is the first question what is an average occupancy rate in each of the room category So here I used a merge function where I merged the two column on the basis of room category and on room ID. After that we get any data on that we use the drop functions to drop the room ID which is a double column so we remove one of them and after using the group by function uh, followed by room class we get occupancy percentage. Second thing print average occupancy rate percentage similarly i used a merge function where i merge the two columns on property id and group by a uh, function followed by the city and there we get our insights third question is when was the occupancy better in the weekday or in the weekend 
Here also I use the merge function and give by function. After that we get the insiders. Weekend is much busier than the weekday. After analyzing all the data, we get that residential room is much occupied by 59.28%. Least booked are standard with the 57.89%. The top city is Delhi with 61.15% and weekends is much busier than weekdays. In terms of in terms of revenue, here we can say that Mumbai earns the more, where Delhi earns very least. Now the recommendation from me to the Atli grant, work with the more online booking sites so they can reach to the more customers. Create weekend offers to boost their booking. Give discount in the Bangalore locations to attract more guests and run more ads in the Delhi location and for the residential room. Lastly, the conclusion and impact after analyzing whole the data, now the Atli grant can understand what was working and what was not for them. And this idea will definitely going to have the Atli grant to increase their revenue, market share, and stay competitive in this tough market. Lastly, thanks for your patience and time. I'm open to any question you may have. Thank you.